In this video, I'm going to show you one of the best Madden 23 money plays, one of the best plays in all of Madden 23, and how to optimize it to be able to attack man coverage, zone coverage, as well as match coverage. Now, the play is out of the gun type formation in the Detroit Lions offensive playbook. If you want to get my entire gun tight offensive ebook, we have multiple playbooks broken down in our Patreon. It's only $10 to become a member. It'll get you access to all of my Madden 23 offensive and defensive ebooks, over 22 two ebooks currently in the patreon and we're dropping a brand new ebook this week so make sure that you're in the patreon the link is in the description it's only 10 bucks to become a member um, so again link down below uh, gun tight bench we're gonna be showing you one of my favorite setups right now um, i love this because it attacks man and zone coverage super super well and we can actually snap the ball fairly quickly uh, with what we're going to show you. So gun tight, play is bench. You don't need any hot route abilities whatsoever. You don't need slot apprentice, hot route master, none of that. You just need um, bench, okay? So what we're going to do is we're going to build around the corner routes. And the setup is really simple. We are going to uh, streak the left receiver. Now, ideally, this play should be run on the left hash mark. OK, um, if we were on the right hash mark, all you have to do is just flip. And the only person that moves is your running back. OK, so anyways, run this on the left hash mark. The setup is we are going to streak Debo Samuel. When you streak someone on the short side of the field, it really does a great job of clearing out zones this year. And then we're going to in route the running back. Very simple setup. Very simple setup. But it's so, so effective. So what you're going to see right here is if they're not playing hard flats, we're going to take that running back over the middle every single time. And that running back is going to draw their user a lot of attention. They're going to have to sit in the middle of the field to take that away off of the rip. And then they're going to have to have hard flats uh, to be able to take it away completely. So um, we're going to have the running back. You also have this out route to the right. Um, if that's covered, then you can start throwing your uh, little corner route here to the left. Now, this corner route to the left is really, really effective um, against pretty much every coverage in the game. Um, now, there is an increasing popularity right now in the Madden community um, of throwing, like, you know, cover four against tight, which I'll come back to in just a second. But as you see right there, cover three, this corner route is open all day long. You can throw this really, really consistently against cover three. And then we're going to go over man coverage real quick, and then we'll talk a little bit about cover two, so or uh, cover four. So with man coverage, um, you have a lot going for you in this play. Uh, if you have short out elite, what you want to do is free form and pass lead that down. And as you can see, um, that corner route is going to get really, uh, it's going to turn it into a very sharp uh, corner route. Now, let's say that your opponent is pressing you. Um, and let's, let's just say your, your opponent is pressing you and they don't have safety help over top. So they're not putting safeties over top. This streak is kind of a sneaky beater, especially if you have short out elite on him, which I really recommend because in the formation uh, of tight, this is the receiver that you would motion out most of the time anyway. Anyways, what you're going to see right here is if they are, um, I actually didn't get pressed that time. I'll show you a play where I get pressed. But if I'm getting pressed, that route right there is going to become something for you that's pretty good. Uh, and again, I want to take the safety away just to kind of show if they're not playing with safety help, on the left this can be a, a very easy touchdown so you'll see right here he's gonna light up he's gonna burn the jam uh, that time he actually kind of got muddied up but by and large um this route to Debo samuel if they press you probably about 80 percent of the time is going to be a touchdown for you okay the major the vast majority of the time if they press you and they don't have like crazy bumps like what i just got that uh streak is going to be a touchdown here's a better example you see wide open over the top touchdown um so if they're playing some kind of press man you have that you have that as an option uh on this play now let's say they're playing man coverage and let's say you know they know that you're running bench so they're going to kind of sell out to stop the right side of the screen or the the left side of the screen then you want to work this right side of the screen this corner right to Taysom hill we're going to free form it basically outside a little bit but mostly down about five o'clock if the joystick was a clock and you see that we can attack the defense that way now i wanted to spend a few minutes talking with you a little bit today about cover four drop because cover four is one of the coverages that you certainly will see um so a couple things with cover four and really the biggest thing to me is to take advantage of free forming down the corner right you have to you have to free form it almost at like seven o'clock 
if my uh, joystick was a clock against cover four, especially if they're going to base a line their cover four. So if they're going to base and line their cover four and give you a look like this, you've got to freeform it down and outside and you want to possession catch it. And if they have deep out zone knockout, a lot of times you'll get those sideline animations that are really helpful. Now, another thing that I did want to talk about as pertains to baseline and pressing is sometimes this corner route to the right, it's a little bit of a difficult throw, but sometimes you can actually freeform and pass lead it up. Right there, we didn't have the separation. There's other plays in this formation that are much better at beating cover four, but um, you can easily throw this left side corner route all day long against it. And then the other thing that you have is your check down to your back because if they go user the corner route on the left then you're going to have this little check down right in here we can say okay we're just going to take a couple yards you know and call a different play if they're consistently uh in a cover four the last thing i want to say about cover four is if you really uh want to utilize this play against cover four motion steve smith steve smith out on a streak to the wide side now they can't guard either side of the cover four and you see we're able to attack that coverage Last coverage that I did want to go over today is match coverage. Um, some of you guys might might not be familiar with the fact that a lot of people, there are coverages in the game that are going to basically play zone man-to-man -man or match coverage. These coverages are oftentimes very valuable when facing um, a gun tight, for example. So I'm going to show you what it looks like uh, if they're going to run some match coverage on you. What you're going to notice is this left side is really, really good against match. This corner round on the left side uh, just typically is going to be open to the left side with, again, that same idea. It's going to play really similar uh, to man coverage, and um, which is fine. Uh, so what you'll see right here is my running back's open to the flat. I've got this corner route down and outside pass lead, as you can see. Very simple, very easy attacking uh, play. Bench is one of the best plays in all of Madden 23. You force them to defend the flats on both sides of the formation at the same time you're also able to attack a lot of zone coverages with that streak corner flat concept to the left side as you can see right here if they're not playing hard flats on either side we have an out route on either side that can take advantage of that and then if they are going to drop into hard flats then we're going to get into this game where we can free form down and outside this little corner route Thank you for watching the video. If you want to get more on the gun tight, make sure you join our Patreon. It's only $10 to become a member. It'll get you access to all of my Madden eBooks. Thanks for watching the video and head down to the description and check out that Patreon link.